Hi, this is Brad Linder with Lilliputing, and I'm here again with the ASRock Ion 330 nettop, which has a dual-core Atom processor and NVIDIA Ion graphics, which gives a little bit more oomph than you get from most nettops or netbooks. Today I'm taking a look at the multimedia capabilities, and for example, I've plugged in uh, ATSC over-the-air high-definition uh, TV tuner. And I'm also going to take a look at flash video playback. People have been asking me, you know, how, how does this perform if you want to use it for things like watching Hulu video in full screen mode? So I'm going to show you that here real quickly. Uh, this is a standard definition, not high definition video from Hulu, but it plays smoothly in full screen mode, something that's difficult to do with a net top or a netbook with uh, integrated GMA 950 graphics. But because this has NVIDIA Ion graphics and um, I'm using Adobe Flash Player 10.1 Beta, it actually plays quite smoothly in full screen mode, and high definition video should work as well. Now I also wanted to show you Windows Media Center, which I have configured with uh, an over-the-air digital antenna right now. I'm going to go ahead and hit Live TV. And it takes a minute to find the signal, but once it does, the live TV playback is actually pretty smooth. And I've also recorded a couple of programs, so I can show you that uh, recorded TV is also just as smooth. You can see the menus and the transitions are pretty smooth here, too. Um, so overall, I have to say that the ASRock IM330 does meet the minimum requirements of what I would expect from a home theater PC. It can play video, it can record video, it can play flash video. Um, the NVIDIA ION graphics processor is actually handling a lot of the heavy lifting here, not the processor itself. So if you wanted to do things like I do with my home theater PC, such as record TV programs and then automatically transcode them into uh, DivX or H.264 or something else to save space, you're going to want to make sure that you've got uh, programs to do the transcoding that can take advantage of the NVIDIA ION acceleration, because it'll take a very long time to do that if you're just using the integrated um, uh, Atom 330 processor. It's not as fast as, as most other processors. But if you just wanted to record you know, 10, 20, 30 hours worth of TV and, and didn't need to transcode it, save space, put it on your iPod or anything like that, um, this, this does work pretty well. And because of the small size, it would, uh, it would fit pretty well in most home theater setups. So again, this is Brad Linder with Lilliputing taking a look at the multimedia capabilities of the ASRock ION 330.